my brothers and sisters. This is another nighttime video, but this time I'm looking at the moon. Isn't it awesome with something flying around? And then there are a couple of stars that you may or may not be able to see that are there as well. But I'm going to reduce it now. I have it um, magnified. So I'm going to reduce it so that you will be able to see what it looks like when it's back to its original size. And now you can see some of the stars that are around. Just wanting you to see a different view of a night sky. Here things are dark. And yet, there are these flecks and just movement that's going on in the heavenlies. Isn't it amazing? I don't know what that is, but it's coming over as red and it's moving, but I'm not exactly sure. Some of you may already know what it is. And then we move into the darkness, and then there's the moon again. I want you to think of how awesome our God is. What an awesome God we have, who has created this world for us to enjoy. And so, I pray that you will be in a position, locked down as we are, to just gaze up at the sky, to just take in all of what's of clear tonight, because tomorrow it should rain, and Sunday it should rain, and so, and even Monday, but here, we're able to somehow pick up, I don't know what, but just movement and motion and harmony. And we're told that there is music around the spheres, the stars, that they make noise, that they're galaxies, and, and there's more to the universe than we can imagine. So remember as a child, we'd sometimes lie down on the grass and look up at the moon and and make up stories. I don't see any face today. It's You can't see it from my video, but it um, looks like a half moon. Um, but it's just amazing that up there, out there, just so much of a vast expanse we cannot conceive. And to even begin to understand light years that something travels years, light years, and then we see it, and it's left. I don't know when. I mean, it's, it's just an incredible and awesome exponential experience of the mystery and magic and wonder and beauty and just greatness of our God who imagines these things and speaks them into being. And when you look at yourself in the mirror, you are another one of those amazing creations of God. Just so amazing. All of the various systems working in your body all simultaneously. And then there's memory and then there's dreaming of the future. I mean, we're moving and as it were capable of moving in different time frames. Just think of your life and how God has been with you, whether you knew it or not. And so my sisters and brothers, God will be with us into the next as well. We're losing so many of our precious loved ones, our dear friends, so many. We just have to ask God's grace and mercy to be with us, that we may be strong and of good courage, to live our best life while we can. God bless you, my dears. God bless you.